electronic surveillance use pen registers and trap and trace devices and use other forms of information gathering for foreign intelligence, counterterrorism, and criminal purposes and for other purposes signed by 17 senators. On this vote, the yeas are 57, the nays are 42. Three-fifths of the senators duly chosen and sworn not having voted in the affirmative. The motion is not agreed to. Mr. President, Mr. President. The majority Leader of the Mr. Senate. Mr. President, the Senate's not in order. We have order. Uh, I've taken a good look at this. For those who want reform and want to prevent the government from holding the data, the Freedom Act is the only way to do it. The House has passed it. The President wants it. All of the intelligence personnel have agreed to it. And I think not to pass that bill is really to throw the whole program, that whole Section 215, as well as the whole business records, the lone wolf, the roving wiretaps, into serious legal jeopardy. Regular order, Mr. President. The Senate has demonstrated that the House passed bill lacks the support of 60 senators. I would urge a yes vote on the two-month extension. By unanimous consent, the mandatory quorum call has been waived. The question is, is it the sen uh, sense of the Senate, the debate on the motion to proceed to S-1357, a bill to extend authority relating to roving surveillance, access to business records, and individual terrorists as agents of foreign powers under the Foreign Intelligence Surveillance Act of 1978 until July 31, 2015, and for other purposes shall be brought to a close. The yeas and nays are mandatory under the rule. The clerk will call the roll. Senate will be in order. If not, on this vote, the yeas are 45, the nays are 54. Three-fifths of the senators duly chosen and sworn not having voted in the affirmative. The motion is not agreed to. Mr. President. Majority Leader. Could we have an order in the Senate? We have entered into a momentous debate. This is a debate about whether or not a warrant with a single name of a single company can be used to collect all the records, all of the phone records of all of the people in our country with a single warrant. Our forefathers would be aghast. This is a high threat period and <clears throat> we know what's going on overseas. We know what's been tried here at home. My colleagues, do we really want this law to expire? We've got a week to discuss it. We'll have one day to do it. 